Okay, the look that um, we are into, thank you. The look that we're into now is actually a European cut look. The European look is a very slim fit look. And it's nothing new. This look, this suit that you have on right now is actually um, the same look that they did back in the 60s and the 70s. Where it's straight leg, very fitted. Uh, the blazers are cropped to where they come just below your waist. Um, if you remember, well, I don't know if you remember, but back in the, in the 90s, the blazers, and the early 2000s, the blazers came a little bit longer. And you tend to have had like a thousand buttons going down the front. Well, we don't do those anymore. And the pant leg were a lot wider with the cuffs. But if you notice, this suit that you have on now, it's a very tapered look. And with the crop blazer. So that's the look that we're going to now, along with the, the skinny tie. Okay. The skinny tie. And pretty much with the skinny tie, we will do uh, just a basic, simple knot on the skinny tie. And pretty much um, you can find a lot of the slim fit look in almost any store now. Uh, I'll give you a perfect example of one high profile celebrity that had to change his look and that was Steve Harvey. Really? Steve Harvey was known for wearing wide leg uh, pant, um, real baggy uh, blazers and that kind of thing but he had to slim down his look because this is what we're going for in our present time. To give you that nice real cool polish up-to-date look to make it real simple and of course you know we do a lot of accessorizing with the pocket square and even flower lapels this little slit right here yep. is what um, we normally will put the flower lapel there okay. and for those of us who can afford you can put a real flower instead of a fake oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so this is pretty much the look um, that we're going for, especially if you're wearing a suit or a blazer, a very nice fitted look. Yeah, nice look. So, um, let me show you what a more urban look would look like. So, thank you, Jordan. Thank you. Uh -huh.